This week's Torah portion is called Ha'azinu. We are in the second to last Torah portion in the entire Torah as we come to the end of the book of Deuteronomy. Every year this Torah portion coincides with this time, these high holy days, when we reflect on the cycle of life. Moses is also reflecting on the cycle of life because in this Torah portion as he recites one of his last poetic announcements to the congregation of Israel, he is about to end, see the end of his life. He's about to climb the mountain and his life will be over. Interesting that we then get to the end of, book of De- the book of Deuteronomy and we turn back to the beginning of the entire Torah. It's not the end of the story. In fact, there are many more books in the Bible. We just go back to the beginning each year as we begin the cycle of the year over again. One of the things that's missing from the end of this story is the fulfillment of the covenant. What does exist in the story is the hope and the promise that the covenant will someday be fulfilled. So as we return to the beginning of the story, go back all the way to the beginning of Genesis as we contemplate creation in the cosmos, we also have to contemplate our place in creation. We have to contemplate ourselves and our lives and our relationships so that we can fulfill that promise of the covenant, that we can take that hope and that desire and that wish and make it become a reality in the year ahead.